Hello friends, today we are going to learn how to provide amazing light and how to create something funny and something different in Photoshop. So let's begin our tutorial. First we are going to take a document page. So just click on file, then, then new and I am taking this size because this one is an ultra HD size. So you can also take 1920 or 1280 but I am going with this one then just click on create so my document is ready and now first we are going to add some images so this galaxy image is our background image so just I place this one in my background so I just place this one so this one is placed and our another image is this one so first we are going to select this image by using selection tool you can also use quick selection tool paint tool and but this time I am going to trying with auto selection so just select and select subject this one is the automatic process to select anything so so you can see that the selection is completed and this one is the very easy process so just drag and drop your image is already placed I think this one is perfect area so this one is placed and our another so this one is our clown image and we are going to select this clown image by using auto selection first we are going to try with auto selection if it's can't select the subject then I'm going with paint tool so it's almost done but some places is not selected by auto selection so this places I select by manually so I'm going with this laser tool press ctrl c plus v so this one is copied and we are going to remove these things and these things also so we just select this one and just remove this area when you select this area just press delete key and do the same thing So this one is done and we are going to place this image in our document page so just place this one so it's almost look too much crazy and its place perfectly and we are going to adjust the hair first so we just take you can go with brush tool so go to brush and color and just zoom your image hold space to adjust the image and we are going to apply some extra hair so go to brush you can choose first color first eye color choose this color okay and then choose hard brush adjust the size of brush by using bracket key and we are going to apply this just like that so the hair adjustment is completed and we are going to apply some shadow to provide realistic look so just take new layer go to brush make opacity 100% and this time we are going to take black color because shadow color is always black so just 
increase the size of your brush and this time we are going to take soft brush so this one is perfect or you can also take this brush do the same thing duplicate this one and go to image and transform and just horizontal and place this shadow in that leg so you can see that the image looks already original and this one is our metal image so just take a new layer go to clipping mask brush and make opacity 20 to 25 percent and we are going to apply this okay so this one is completed and the another work is we are going to add some light so this one is balloon and I'm, I think I give this orange light so take new clipping marks linear recurs then go to solid and select the color so this one is look good then just inverse control plus control i so this layer max is inverted and go to brush and make foreground color white make opacity 100 percent and just apply this so the balloon is already glow and the another work is we are going to select labels make more brighter so this one is become more brighter go to blending option and this time we hold alt key then add some so okay so this one is completed and our next task we just make this clown image little bit darker first we inverse this one and then go to brush and just apply wait a minute we are apply this one little bit outer side so the outer side is looks more glower okay this one is completed our another work we just make this one little bit darker so we take curves i think this one is perfect place and we are going to adjust this one in black then <coughs> we are just click on uh, level layer and apply the levels go to brush tool or exposure exposure is also perfect just inverse the layer and we are going to apply the light so this one is almost done and we just add more light so our next work is we just take new layer go to blending option select solid color and just apply 
the light okay i think this one is the perfect light i think okay so just inverse so this one is layer and go to brush and this time we just adjust the opacity like 17 percent and take this one so the glow effect is already come out and our next work the background color is blue so we are going to add some blue color in this area so take this one like that i think this one is perfect go to your layer and just inverse this one and simply apply the color blue color our another worker is we are going to add some more images to provide something different look so just follow the steps Merge the complete line in one layer by pressing shift ctrl alt plus e then right click convert the smart object go to filter camera raw and the start adjustment then ok so our work is completed and we just finish our work so if you spend more time then you can get more better result in your photoshop work so see you soon with new another tutorial goodbye